So this is going to be a video on how to make some games detect your joystick on your Windows computer. In the previous video I showed you how to connect this joystick to the computer itself and showed a couple of examples when this controller worked in some games and did not work in some other games without any extra applications installed on this computer. Now I will show you how to actually make the Asphalt Unite game detect this joystick with an extra application that you need to install. I've already installed this application on my computer. So these are the files that I just downloaded. We will talk about DS for Windows application today. It is downloaded from the internet in a zip format and then you have to extract it. So when you extract it you just get this application in a folder. So you'll have to run this file DS4 Windows. And this program helps the Unite game to detect your joystick. Let me just show you how it works before I start showing you the steps how to install it. So let me run the game first. Let's first of all check what we have in the settings. Game settings, controls. And we can see that there is a keyboard detected only and no joystick detected although it is activated and it is connected to the computer via Bluetooth connection. And let's run that program now. You just need to go to that folder and run this ds4windows.exe file. It will open this window here and will detect your joystick automatically. Now that's it. You can start playing. Now I'm back in the Unite and you see that there was a keyboard pictures, now there's a joystick pictures. And this joystick has this nice feature, the touchpad, you can check. You see the touchpad is already working. You can also see that the game is reacting to the movements on the joystick. So that's it. So how do we do that? Let me delete that program and show how you do it from the very beginning. So to install this program we need to go to the internet and search the internet by the name of the application. It was called DS4 Windows. Let's search. And this is the page where you download this tool from. You can read the instructions but I will go to the download button directly. Let's download. So now it's in my folder. I can extract it to my folder here or I can extract it to a folder where I will keep it. So having it in downloads folder is not a good idea. Let's extract it to some folder. I will create the joystick folder and will extract it here. Extract. Do not extract it to the protected folders, system folders, windows folders. So here we have this folder and we'll just run this file here. We turn on the joystick and it is detected. And from now on you can play the games you want to play. But just keep in mind, in some games you still need to check the settings, the control settings, in case you need to turn all those settings on or off. 